Hi everybody. I wanted to do a quick video and talk about creases in your canvas. Now, generally, it's just the paper that's creased. Okay, it may not look very good at times, you know, but it's really the paper. Um, you really do not need to put books on it. You can, you know, if you're going to work on it the next day, lay it out on your table and put some heavy books on it. Uh, you will also hear uh, people say to flip it over to the back, put a tea towel on it, and then on a very low setting real quickly, uh, quick movements, uh, iron the back of it. But you really don't need to. I don't know how many canvases I've had that were wrinkled of sorts, whether it was, you know, the canvas up here in the corner of the edges because they put the canvas in too big of a, uh, too small of a box and they rolled uh, the edges under. It, it really doesn't matter. All you really need to do is when you start working on your canvas is just put it down on the table. That's it. What I do is I run some masking tape across the top. This one I only have two pieces. But this but that's just to keep it down. But as you work on it, if your canvas itself is wrinkled, putting the drills down is going to flatten it out. So you really don't have to do anything special. Now, here it's the paper. Okay? You can see it's bowed. There's nothing wrong with this canvas. It's just when the paper was laid down, it rolled up like that. So all you really have to do, if it really does bother you, and I can understand it bothering people because when you put down your tray, it might move a lot more, you know, or go like this when you go to put your pen down to get drills. I get that. I understand that. But really, all you need to do is just cut your canvas, you know, with an X-Acto knife and go down. And then what I do, ah, my hand's sticking. If, the, if it really bothers you that much, boy, I'm trying to get this up. Sorry, bear with me. Let me take this off first. Okay. Once you've cut the canvas with an X-Acto knife, as far down as you need it, just see how, you know, that is. We're just going to pull it back. See? There's nothing wrong with the canvas. Now, if for some reason your your glue is has a bubble in it, just take an X-Acto knife and cut the bubble and then pat it with your finger and lay it back down. It'll be fine. So I pulled this back. So all I'm going to do is take my hand and lay it back down. And if you, if you didn't actually lay it down straight enough, just pick it up again. And there you go. This section here. I assure you, if I had two hands, this would lay down a whole lot better. But it's, that's all you really have to do. 
like I said, if I had two hands, I would be able to use two hands to to push this down, but it really isn't sticking up that much, even though it looks like it. But that's really all you have to do, people. You know, just cut your canvas with an X-Acto knife, pull, pull the paper back, and then hold on to the paper with one hand, and then rub it as you go, and your canvas will lay straight. If you have any questions or comments, please put them down below. Have a great evening.